7 News at 10 starts now. Larry Nassar's former boss, William Strample, now has his own mugshot after investigators revealed new accusations against him. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Sarah Swistak. Prosecutors say William Strample pressured female medical students to have sex with him by threatening to ruin their careers if they chose not to. He's also accused of groping multiple women. In addition to those accusations, the attorney general's team says Strample failed to supervise Larry Nassar during exams. Fox 47's Alani Latang was in court today and has more on his arraignment. Here on the record in the matter of the state of Michigan versus William Strample. William Strample sits in video arraignment. His attorney inches from the representatives from the attorney general's office, accusing him of misconduct in office, neglect and criminal sexual conduct. Serious charges uh, involving a violation of public trust. I would ask the court to order uh, some cash bond I think is appropriate. Strample's lawyer says he did nothing wrong. My client denies that he ever engaged in any inappropriate touching of anyone, any student or otherwise. He denies that there was any quid pro quo for sexual favors in exchange for any type of standing within the university of the medical school. Strample's lawyer also says the charges that he didn't keep a close enough eye on Larry Nasser are false. My client did instruct Mr. Nasser of those protocols, of the needs that any doctor should be following. He followed up with Mr. Nasser. Prosecutors asked the judge to impose bond and order Strample not to leave the country. Investigators could not find a passport when they searched his home last night. News 10 has the only video of state police working at his house in DeWitt. The judge also put limitations on where he can be on MSU's campus. Given that he's still a faculty member, uh, although on medical leave, uh, it would be appropriate, I think, to restrict his movements uh, over there on campus. And that was Alani Latang reporting. Strample is scheduled to be back in court on April 27th.